Hey guys, I'm Spencer from Pixel and Bracket, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a transparent background in Adobe Photoshop. Yeah. Now, let me introduce to y'all as the one son of a musician refused to fall. Making a background transparent in Photoshop is actually pretty easy. So let's open up a new document by going up to File, New, or Command N on a Mac. And from there, we're just going to set it up to be a 1920 by 1080. I'm going to uncheck Artboards. Resolution, RGB, all that, it's all, just leave it as default. So we'll create a new document. And every new document starts with a nice big white background. And that background's over here in your Layers panel. But generally, it's locked and you can't do anything to it. It'll yell at you actually and tell you, hey, you can't do anything to this. Now it may come up and say convert to a normal layer. It may also not say anything. It may just say you can't do that. And so uh, we're going to cancel out of that. I'm going to show you how to unlock this. Just click the lock icon and that unlocks that background layer. You could also double click in this empty space and it'll say, oh, you want to create a new layer down there? And I can name it and hit OK does the same thing. So from here, you would think that, oh, I just delete this now, but I can't, it won't let me do that. And that's because there's no other layers in my document. So I need to create a new layer first by either creating a, you know, a text layer with your type tool, you can create a shape layer, or you can just hit new layer and create a new blank empty layer. So I'm gonna do that, and now I have layer one. And notice this checkered pattern, that's transparency. So this layer is completely transparent, this layer is white, if I delete that, now I have the checkered pattern on my background, which means I now have a transparent background. So anything that I create on top of this, if I grab my text tool, we'll grab some uh, black text here, trans, let's see if I can spell this right, transparent. All right, this shape is opaque, right? You can't see through that, but then everything in between all of the areas where you see checkered pattern is transparent. So now from here, you would want to go to file and save as and save it as a format that will hold that transparency. So something like, a, you know, like a PNG file will hold the transparency, a PDF file will hold it, a JPEG file will not. So if you're trying to save it as a JPG file dot JPG, you won't have transparency on that. It will uh, convert anything that's transparent to a white background. Make sure you're saving it in a file format that accepts the transparency and make sure that you've got that checkered background and you have no white background layer as your bottom layer. That's it for this tutorial. If you guys learned something like this video, subscribe for more tips, tutorials, and freebies. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.